Do you enjoy using your desktop email client's group email features and are disappointed with the iPhone's lack of native group emailing capabilities? So are we. We've used contact groups for years in Gmail and none of those are accessible for use in the native mail app. So how does one go about setting up groups to email on the iPhone? One excellent solution is MailShot by Soluble Apps. Now there are a handful of third-party iOS apps available that will access your iPhone contacts and group them according to your criteria. The problem with these apps is that you have to open the app to access your created groups. Then you need to compose and send your email from within those third-party apps. Advantage MailShot. Why? Because unlike the competition, MailShot will allow you to create and edit groups, then update your native iPhone contact app with those groups. Why does this matter? For one very big reason. You can access those groups from within any app that talks with the native contacts or mail apps. So you can be in Safari and email out a website link to a group all without leaving the Safari app. And we have a group of friends who we've created in MailShot that we can send out app price drops from within the App Shopper app. Pretty cool. Let's talk about another advantage MailShot has over the competition. Attachments. With those other apps that limit you to accessing the ma and mailing your groups from within their apps, how do you add attachments? Good question. Unless those apps allow document sharing with other apps, you can't. MailShot frees you of this entire process simply by allowing you to email your groups from the default iPhone mail app. That's it. Most apps utilize the default mail app to send attachments, so now you'll have all your groups right there. Now how do you create a group from within MailShot. Open the app, click Groups and hit Create New MailShot Group. Name the group and begin adding contacts from within your address book. When you're finished, hit Update in the upper left and MailShot will update your address book with this new group. Now you can even go back into MailShot and edit your groups by adding or removing contacts and this will also edit that group in the address book. Then you can ex exit the MailShot app and your newly created groups will be available to email from within any other app that supports mailing. You can give MailShot a try for free and add up to three groups containing up to five contacts in each. To remove these restrictions and mail up to 50 contacts requires an in-app purchase. Now we've got a large group that we've created with MailShot and the email works seamlessly. Now to be fair, MailShot doesn't do anything that your iPhone won't allow you to manually do. You can create a group in your iAddress book by adding a new container contact with multiple email addresses separated by commas. But frankly, this will drive you insane if you have more than, say, three contacts you want to add. And the frustration of editing a group created that way justifies the in-app purchase price any day. We give MailShot our 5-star AppChasers rating.